FFG Enterprise, based at Garden Island in New South Wales, exists to provide seaworthy guided missile frigates to the Royal Australian Navy. In 2014, with increased pressure to reduce costs on the FFG program, it was recognised that significant change was needed to ensure continued delivery to the Navy. This was achieved through the formation of a new operating model, the FFG Enterprise. A fundamental shift in how military capability was sustained with industry working together with Defence to meet the Navy's demands for warships that are reliable, available, affordable and lethal. The FFG Enterprise has been a game changer for Defence. If we cut back to the past, not so long ago, there was real arm's length relationships between Defence and Defence industry. So in this FFG Enterprise we've got Navy, CAS Group, TALUS and BAE working together to achieve great things. We've created a safe environment to collaborate. We've increased the trust, we've reduced the transactional costs, and we've sped things up. Since inception in 2014, every FFG has been delivered from maintenance on time or ahead of time. So the agility in this new organisation is just amazing. The underlying culture also had to evolve along with this change to ensure that the contracts continued to achieve their intent. The FFG Enterprise enables BAE Systems and TALUS to work together to provide the Navy the outcome that it requires, which is serviceable and capable ships at sea. The two parties, BAE and TALUS, are typically rivals in a commercial sense. This has seen a need to change the way that they behaved from a previous position to a very collaborative position focusing on the outcomes for the Navy. Today, they work together to provide solutions that enable maintenance and execution activities to occur in a timely manner and cost effectiveness to the Navy. The end result is an enterprise that has proven to deliver and trusted to sustain the Navy's air warfare capability. As a commanding officer of an FFG class ship, I need to have confidence that the FFG enterprise is delivering the best capability on time, every time. This will allow me to sail the ship and meet the operational requirements of not only the Royal Australian Navy, but the Australian Government. It's a collaborative approach. It's working closely with industry and Navy to achieve the operational outcome. Since the inception of the FFG Enterprise, Navy has seen increased reliability of the FFG class frigates, and also ships have been coming out of maintenance ahead of schedule, which has given operational days back to the Navy to allow us to go out and meet the requirements of the Australian Government. In October 2016, the FFG Enterprise was honoured with an international award for innovation. The collaboration between defence and industry was recognised as a world-leading relational contracting practice. To get the FFG Enterprise to the point where it has been recognised through, through defence and through industry and on the international stage that it is a working construct, we faced a whole bunch of challenges. And it's been due to the willingness of people to make it work, both leaders and employees, that has been the secret of its success. Everything we do should be geared towards getting ships away on time every time from their availabilities, uh, delivering lethal FFGs to the Navy that are capable of being deployed to achieve their mission and getting crews home safely from their mission. It's a great feeling to know that by working collaboratively with our FFG enterprise partners, we are playing a key role in helping our Navy to protect our nation. The enterprise has been so successful, it is now seen as an exemplar and it is planned to roll out the relational contracting model through the rest of Defence. The FFG enterprise has achieved outstanding results and is now influencing the future of Defence contracts in Australia.